Hi, I'm Lexter, a product specialist at CV Linens. Everyone wants the decor at their event to leave a lasting impression. We've seen some beautiful decor trends come and go in the past few years, but classics never go out of style. One of our favorite traditional decor pieces is a wooden floral letter. This is a great staple for any event because you can create initials, a full name, or table numbers for weddings, baby showers, or even birthday parties. We know that events can get pretty pricey, which can be overwhelming when you're on a budget. Whether you're getting into event planning or you're a bride looking for the most bang for your buck, DIY is an affordable and personable way to have a striking and trendy decor. Today, we have an easy step-by-step -step tutorial on how to create a show-stopping DIY wood and floral letter. Let's begin. For this tutorial, you'll need four items, spray paint, a hot glue gun with glue, a wooden letter of your choice, and any of our artificial silk flowers. Step one, spray paint your letter. Before you start spray painting, make sure you're in a well-ventilated area. You'll want to put cardboard or craft paper down to protect the surface you're painting on. For our base, we're using ivory spray paint, but you can use any color that goes with your event's theme or color palette. Begin by spray painting your letters. To get an even coat of paint, sweep the can horizontally and vertically as you spray. Keep the can around one foot away from your letter for a more polished look. Make sure you get all of the edges of the letter and let the paint dry fully before flipping it over so that there are no marks or imprints made on the paint. Once you have your base color down and completely dry, you can move on to step two, or you can go over the letter again with glitter spray paint for an extra touch. Step two, prep your florals. While your letter is drying, you can prep your florals. For this project, we're using our silk rose bush in white and our mini orchid garland in cream. Simply remove each flower from their stem and set them aside. Step three, floral arrangement. Lay your letter out and start to arrange the flowers until you find your desired look. You can rearrange the flowers as much as you want until it's just right. One trick to making it look visually appealing is to place your largest flower in the middle and work your way out in size to create a cascading effect. Step four, glue. Use your hot glue gun to start attaching your flowers to the wood. If the stems on the flower are too long, simply cut them with standard scissors. Once the glue is dry, you're all set. You now know how to create a gorgeous wood and floral letter with your own personal touch for your next event. A link to our full selection of artificial silk flowers can be found in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching and happy decorating.